Hi there, my name is Iran and I'm the current president of NUS Electronic Music Lab, also known as ENL. Today I'm going to be talking to you about who we are, what we do, and why you should join us. EML was founded in 1985. We are a unique music performance group that creates, performs, and promotes original electronic music. Members have opportunities to compose and produce original electronic music, remix tracks, and develop their sound engineering and production skills using the club's own equipment and state-of-the-art digital audio workstation software, namely Ableton Live. EML is mentored by Ableton Certified Trainer Mr. Benjamin Ang, one half of Singaporean synth-pop duo Cosmic Armchair, and himself an EML member back during his student days. Now let us pump the brakes for a moment. If you're new to the world of electronic music, you would probably still have lots of questions like what is an Ableton Live? What is a remix? And what on earth do you folks exactly do at EML? Now to help answer some of these questions and more, I'd like to welcome our Vice President Sean to give a little demonstration. Hi, I'm Sean and I'm the Vice President of EML. Today I'm going to give you guys a quick preview of what music making is like. There's many ways to do it, so here's one way that you can make music. Step 1. Record your instrument. You've just successfully recorded your instrument. Step 2. Put all the sounds together. Step 3 Add more sounds Congratulations, you've just made music. Okay, but seriously though, at EML, you will learn to do what I just did, and so much more. We will equip you with the skills to help you be on your way to making the music that you love. Alright, and that was a quick preview of what music making is like. Back to you, Iram. Now that you have a better idea of who we are and what we do, let us take a closer look at some of our seniors' past performances. Collectively, EML's musical output spans a diverse range of genres, ranging from house, trance, electronica, breakbeat, drum and bass, synthwave, vaporwave, and many, many more. Here at EML, we never restrict ourselves to any one genre, and instead, explore any genre that we can find that inspires us to make better music. 
However, in light of the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic, much of our club's activities have been relegated online. I sat down together with some of my EML friends in an online call and asked them about their time so far in the CCA. Okay, hi everyone. Yeah, um, I'd just like to ask you all some questions about your time in EML. So can you all um, just tell me why did you all join EML? What was the reason behind your uh, choosing to join this CCA? So uh, actually, I already had a bit of production experience like coming into EML. But I'm assuming most of the producers out there will know it's mostly just you in the bedroom just staring at the screen. Music production, I think, for me at least, inherently is kind of a journey you can take alone. So that was kind of boring for the most of my time. So finding EML and NUS was a good way to say that hey, I have a community of people who actually like to do the same stuff that I like to do. Yeah, so I would say I'm a bit of the opposite of Aaron because I have about close to zero production experience. Uh, coming in, I was absolutely like just clueless about the whole door thing. It was super daunting and man, I remember like writing the first track and you know, yeah, the, the experience is really interesting because you see yourself grow in the well, I've been here for like a year-ish plus actively already. Just seeing the thing comparison between the first track and the current level of tracks is just it feels super satisfying. Uh, I think the, the really great experiences were more so the, the collaborations where I was able to work with other people. So things like Omniverse, things like uh, here, Arts Carnival last year, where we were able to collaborate with Stage and all that. Uh, being able to interact with other people with the same level of passion, same level of commitment to what we kind of want to do is it's really heartwarming. Right? I joined EML because I love music and I love making music. Been doing it for a good number of years now. Yeah, so I, I joined because, I guess like Aaron said, like I really wanted to also meet like-minded people, people who were also into it, whether you are just starting out or you have many years of experience, I think there's still a lot to learn from one another. And like your varied styles and the way that you approach music, I think all this is like really refreshing. Because if you do it alone, it's kind of, yeah, like, it's kind of sad, like Aaron was saying. <laughs> so yeah, it's really fun to be around all of y'all. Yeah, go EML. So I joined EML basically very similar to all three of them. Before this, I was in like music CCA also, so I wanted to try something more different. So I started producing on my own. But uh, I also want to have like a community that embraces your um, kind of music and style and everything. And it makes you feel more confident. And I did in fact learn a lot, a lot more things than like, learning by myself. So it's a good platform. Now, EML prides itself in being a community of open-minded music enthusiasts and creatives. Whether you have been producing music on your own for a very long time or have never touched a keyboard in your life, so long as you have the heart to learn and the heart to grow, EML would like to welcome you into our community with open arms. To find out more about our CCA and how to join us, visit us at our website at nuseml.com and follow our Instagram at emusiclab. Also, do check out the web link and QR code beside me to sign up for our upcoming recruitment events. Thank you very much for watching and we do hope to see you at our upcoming events. See you!